Are you currently copying and pasting all your conversations with ChatGPT into a Word document or Google Docs? If so, this video is for you. Did you know that you can download all your chat contents in just a few clicks? All you gotta do, come down here to your account, click these three dots, and then go to settings, and go to data controls, and click export data. Once you confirm your export, you're just gonna say that you should receive an email shortly with your data. And then uh, just close this and go to your email. And the email says your data export is ready. Just click download data and it will um, download a file. You just open this and this is what you're gonna see. Uh, click on the chat, this little um, window over here and it's going to open all your conversations into a uh, your browser. Uh, so basically this is the, the title of the chat, right? Uh, which is this thing right here. And user, of course, it's you and your prompt. And this is ChatGPT and all the answers and all your conversations are saved in here. And it's also search searchable. So if you do a control F or command F, if you're on Mac, you can uh, blog, schedule. Um, this is right here, right? If you're looking for social media, everything that you created that has the, the keyword social media will be here. And you just gotta look for that. Now, for example, if it's something that you use a lot, like for example, I ask for a lot of formulas, for Google Sheets. So this is going to give me over 5,000 results. <laughs> and I mean, I could keep going like this, you know, but that would take me forever. So I did what I do best. I created a tool for that. Uh, it's called Chat Saver Pro, and it's a Google Sheets template where you enter um, your chat title, and then you copy this unique link and you add into a database, uh, which is right here. Let me open that for you real quick so I can show you. Uh, I have a separate video showing exactly how it works, but basically uh, on the database tab, you enter the title or short description. It doesn't even have to be the same title that is here because some, for example, like new chat, like some don't even have you know a title and I don't even bother renaming them. But what I do, I enter that here I enter the prompt that I use and you know you can categorize it add some tags and then here you're going to insert the chat link which is this chat it's this um, letters and numbers right here and each chat has like a different and unique link so when you enter that here you can come back to that and um, you can see the whole conversation in chat GPT now again remember if you clear your chats, um, I don't think you have access back to them. I know that if you try to export the data, that's not gonna work, right? So if this is clear, your history is not saved inside ChatGPT. So then that will not, nothing will come out. Um, and then I'm not sure about the link though. Let me see if I can save this link right here. I'm just gonna insert that here and um, I'm gonna delete that chat. There we go. So it's deleted. Um, now let me see if I click if you will open that or if you will give me an error. Yeah, it says you will enable to unlock the So whatever you have, once you clear that conversation, the chat history, because you can clear everything if you click here and click clear conversations. So once you click on that, it's gone forever. <laughs> so um, you can either do, you can do the export, but then you can also um, use this tool. And this tool, the cool thing about this, it has a searchable, uh, it's a searchable database. So you can enter the keyword here and it will bring up all the results that have that. And it's categorized, so you can filter by category. There's tags, there's a lot more information that you can use to be searchable, right? That to, instead of coming here, for example, this is like 5,000, over 5,000 uh, uh, keywords that you found 
<laughs> my whole chat history. So that's a lot. But um, yeah, so that's why I created this. But it's good to have, it's good to know, and it's good to have this because you can save your whole history, right? Um, just don't clear them in ChatGPT. <laughs> I don't think for now they're not charging for storage or anything, so you're good, you're safe. And then, uh, yeah, then I would use this to make your search um, faster. It's just like productivity-wise, this tool is better. But you also have this option, and you have you do have the searchable, you know, function. And here is the Control F. Uh, so then it has all your history from all your conversations with ChatGPT. Well. Hope that was helpful. Let me know if you have any questions. Thank you.